Good evening and welcome back to Let's Play Grim Fandango. When we left off last time, I wasn't really sure what to do, and I'm still not entirely positive, but off screen I tried the, the, the tried and true point and click adventure strategy of just click on everything and try every random thing that comes to mind. Um, and I decided, I thought, well the key that, that's going to be inside Nick's cigarette case, I'm assuming he's going to probably open this thing, right? So I thought, well let's go here. I tried asking Gladys to look at it and Manny just says, I don't want to do that. But when you show the cigarette case to Carla, we've actually got some dialogue options. If I can remember where, there, there we go. So maybe she can help us open it, even though she's angry at us. What's that? So, do we lie and try to charm her? It's a little something special I bought for you. Don't try to make nice, Manny. It's too late. Okay, well. What? Cigarettes? What does it look like? Don't try to make nice, Manny. It's too late. Oh, come on. One of these options has to be useful. What? a new compact for your makeup. Manny, I don't wear makeup, you know that. And I'm not saying you need to. Good. All right. What? I don't know. I found it under your desk. Unattended? Mm. No, there was a shifty-looking guy with crazy eyes who put it there. Better investigate. Oh my God. Give me that. It's a bomb. It <laughs> That's this is a bit of an overreaction, Carla. Really? Ha ha! Another senseless act of terrorism nipped in the bud by security officer Carla. Wow. It was completely destroyed by our own oh. detonator, so I can't tell what kind of bomb it was. But here's something. <laughs> oh, Carla. <laughs> A key. I better bring that to Chief Bogan. Yeah, you can analyze it with your metal detector. Thank you, Carla. Okay, so no, this is... I was thinking this was like... Somehow I was thinking that it was a safe for storing things. No, it's for blowing things up. But that was handy. We've got a key now. Okay. Now, that might have been a clue, though. She said you can give it to Bogan. And we don't want to take it to him, but maybe to... Well, no, it seems like it should be for something over there to get uh, Charlie's briefcase of money. But I don't know. She said Bogan, so now I'm thinking we should go and check the jail. Well, Carla, you have been exceedingly helpful, so thank you for that. This key doesn't work there. No? Aw. Well, bummer. I was hoping it would. Okay. No, it makes more sense that it would be back here. But where's it? Uh, it's gonna be down in the basement, and I still don't know how to get there. Shoot. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Actually, I wanna... What was Nick doing with this key? What was Nick doing with this key? And it was a key... Well, is it for Charlie? Because it was a key that was meant for me in that letter. I feel like a... I, th I feel like a fool. Obviously there is some locked door somewhere that I should probably be able to think of immediately. Manny, across the bridge, please. Um, and it's not coming to mind. What is this key gonna open? Well, let's poke around. I don't think we need to mess with Carla. Well, maybe we do. This key doesn't work there. No. Well, that was a thought. Okay. She's not gonna let us upstairs. Is 
Is there something locked over here? I really like this clarinet music that plays here. Ba -ba -ba -ba. All right, moving ahead. Yeah, get in there. Okay, let's. There. Ah, uh, Manny. Go. There go, you go. go. Get that uh, mouth. There wasn't anything locked in here, right? No, 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 no. In here. No, open that back up. No, I'm pretty sure there's nothing that we need to... Nah. Hmm. Open it up on the straightaways, Giddy! Run! But you know, I am just now realizing we probably did need to get Gladys here because he occasionally calls for more wine. So, when we manage to drain the wine, Gladys is going to ask for more, our waiter is going to try to get some, but the ton's going to be empty, and so he'll have to call for a new one. Okay, yeah, so that will all work together. We just have to work out how to drain that thing first. Alright, there's- I don't know why I'm going over there. Um, No, um, we can't go in there. I yet. don't think it would be a good idea to barge into Max's office while he's meeting with Nick. I know. I'm. I don't know what I'm doing, Manny. I'm going in all the wrong directions. Cause I'm distracted by how I'm going to drain this wine. Okay. Uh, Monsieur, a little wine up here, please. Okay. Then we can get out of you here. I don't know what. I mean, this way, do we? There's nothing else in the kitty litter room, right? I don't think so. I don't know what we could really do with this. This. I don't know, my, my wow, inclination. Somebody really liked this cat. At this point, beloved Sanspoof, this regal. Okay, we read about Sanspoof before. My thought with this at this point is that it's just something interesting to look at. I don't think there's necessarily a puzzle we need to solve there, although I could well be wrong. Um, so let's. There's nothing horrible that we want to do to Sanspoof, is there? We don't want to destroy wow, this in any way, right? Really like this cat. Hmm. Pretty sure this is not gonna work, and the I don't. The can opener wouldn't work there. Yeah, I don't think we really want to do that, anyhow. I kind of don't want to bust into this, but you know. I don't really want to do that. I don't think there's anything this key doesn't here. work there. Nah. All right, just because we're right here and we're trying everything out, but I don't think we want to do this either. I don't want to mess up my blade. Okay, I thought not. Well, good. Let's just leave Sanspoof alone. All right, done. Was there like a piece of tubing somewhere that I could slice off? Locked, right? Maybe? No? Come on! 
No, it's not gonna open this either. He's gonna just tell me. This key doesn't seem to go with that lock. Yeah. I feel like I'm missing something very obvious here, and I am not. What is it? Okay, I don't think we need to go back towards the tattoo parlor. I think we're done there. We got the, we got Narana's tags. It's locked. I know, I locked it. Probably not. And it would be really obvious to unlock it with him right here, but... This key doesn't work there. Alright. Is there anything back here? No. Okay. Nor up here. Oh, I just now noticed the little... Okay, wait, go back. Look at the moon, Manny. That was kind of cool. This key doesn't work there. No, no, put the key away. We're looking at the little, the face on the moon. It shone pale as bone as I stood there alone. And I thought to myself how the moon that, that night cast, cast light, light on my heart's true delight. delight and, and the, the reef where her body was, was strewn. Hmm. Huh. Don't have that kind of equipment. <laughs> Don't have that kind of equipment. The SS Limbo needs a little TLC. Alright. So we can mess with something at the blue casket. Or we could head back this way. Let's wander through. I feel like we're taking baby steps here. What's this book? Or am I just gonna look at the customers? Labor organization and revolt made easy. I need this. Hey, can I borrow this book? Why? So you can freak out our plans for organizing labor and go rat us out to your pal, Chief Bogan? No, hey, for the bees. something to read on the can, all right? No dice, Cumberbund. Mm. Hey, no dice. How am I going to get it? Here, look at this. Hey, did I ever tell you guys that you remind me of my friend? Salvador Limones. Salvador yeah. Limones is a fairy tale, a spook story the man tells the masses as he puts them to sleep. Ah, he's a real deal. Salvador Limones is a very real and a very great, great man. And he sends me messages. So how about you give me that book? He also writes a mean letter. What is this? I, Salvador Limones, salute you, Manuel Calavera. Yeah. A great ally in this noble revolution. So how about you that? Really know Salvador Limones? Oh, What's I do. Like? Why didn't you tell us you were a freedom fighter, Manuel? I can't talk about my underground gig, man, where I put the whole scene in Dangerville. Wow. Heavy. Hey, uh, I've got a split, so, um... Can I have that book? Viva la revolucion. Oh, man. Yeah, I'll be taking this. Would you catch mine if I dug on this book for a while? Knock yourself out, brother. Yes! Yes! Okay. And we are going to immediately run this out to our worker bees. Oh, fellas. I have something that may be useful to you. I think these are the words you're looking for. The workers shall control the means of production. The workers shall control the means of production. Yes, that's it. That's what I've been trying to say. Yes, yes. Who will stop the fat cats of industry from building these ships 
with the pollen of the exploiting working class! I say we fight back! And give me your tools! Hmm, what's this? Maybe a bee agitator? I say lay down your tools right now! Yes! And show the man just who makes the honey around here! Oh, yeah. That does it. Careful there, Manny. <gasps> you know, I always thought bees came in two colors. Yellow and black. But you look all red to me, my friend. Ah! Hey, what are you doing? We've got the right to assemble peacefully. Yeah. Good. You're going to need a lot of assembly after we take you apart, comrade. <gasps> oh, no. Oh. Hey, get me a lawyer. Get me a lawyer! Hogan. Nick. That's gonna make it tough to spring the kid and get him back out here. Good thing I know a lawyer who owes me a favor. I didn't want to get him arrested. I just wanted to get a union card and some tools. Where's his hammer? Yes, I still want to steal his tools. We don't want it to be all for naught, right? So, what are you guys doing to free Terry? Hmm. Guys. This is up to me. Well, I will free Terry. Oh, let's... So... Oh, okay. We can click on where Terry hmm. used to be? Guess it's up to me. They look busy working up a plan to free Terry. Alright. Um, so guys, what happened with Terry's hammer? Because I could, I could use that. It, it would be super helpful right now. This is what's locked. The obvious thing that I couldn't think of. Well, awesome. We are accomplishing things. I'm so excited. Alright. It's locked. It is. But we have a key that just might open her up. Awesome. Yes, yes. Get in there. Manny, go inside. Yeah. You may not want to see me like this. Lola, what happened? Did Nick do this to you? Yeah, he got <gasps> that picture real bad. But he's never gonna find it, that thing. You get him, Lola. I'll show Max the picture for you and fix Nick for good. Just tell me where you hid it. Oh, Manny, it's all my fault. Always falling for the wrong guys. You know, I even had a thing for you once. But you were so hung up on that Meche woman, I, I figured I didn't have a chance. Lola, where's the picture? Tell me, Manny, would I have had a chance? Oh, Lola, this yeah, isn't the important thing right now. She just want Olivia for me. Tell her to improve her taste in men, or she'll end up just like me. Tell her to get a nice guy, Manny. Like you. <gasps> Lola! Lola! That was horrible! Oh, and there's the picture, huh? Oh, Lola. Hey, there's a picture of a tongue on it. And it says number 22, Lengua. I have a feeling that's gonna be it for there, but... Well... <sighs> We gotta move on, we got things to do, but there's also a murder here that we gotta we gotta get justice for her. Alright, is there anything else up here? Or was the game sending me way back out there its way of saying, quit messing around in here, it's not gonna help you. Yeah, it looks an awful lot like. Uh Oh, there it is. Hey, there's a picture of a tongue on it. And it says number 22, Lengua. Huh. Well, I'm sure it'll be useful for something. Okay, 
So. What a bummer. Okay, well, wait. I was gonna go here first, but. Warn Olivia. Um. And why am I blanking on which one's Olivia? I thought Lola was our po poet in here, but the voice of the one dying there didn't sound like the self-assured woman telling poetry. No. It's Olivia. Ophelia. This is Olivia. Okay, yeah. So I got him a little mixed up. Okay, Olivia. Manny, we gotta tell her about Lola. Well, catch you later, hip chick. Keep practicing that lingo, man. You'll get it. All right. Wait, maybe we should show her the lingo card. And maybe it means something to her. All right. What do you know about this, Livia? I don't really want to do that. Alright, while we're here, let's check really quick. Is there anything hose-like? Nothing in the dishwasher. Not portable. Not to sound like a capitalist oppressor, but I have people who do that for me now. Well, I just want you to reach inside and see if there's, I don't know, like a hose or something you can rip out. Ooh, food waste. All right, let's get out of here. Du -du -du -du. There's probably a faster way to do this, but this will work. Well, it would work if I clicked on the proper direction. This one. Rubicava. A much more dangerous town than I realized. Alright. This is it! So then, oh, is Nick back in his seat now? You can do it. No, he's not. He's still in here. That's a good I guy. don't think it would be a good idea to barge into Max's office while he's meeting with Nick. All right. Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. Je vous prie de m'excuser. Almost there. Hmm. Where do I want to go then? I could try talking to Membrio. Mm. What do you think? I don't really want to do that. Alright, I had a feeling not. Well, there's got to be something I can do with this guy, right? I don't think he wants those. There's gotta be something I can do with this. I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. But what use is it, Manny, if you're not gonna actually make any tickets or anything with it? I gotta find some paper or something I can use that on. Mm. I don't think we want to bug Carla. Alright. Let's talk to Membrio. Oh, 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 over here. There you go. Anything new?
Okay, I don't think so. This is the same animation we had before. Well, don't let always. All right, let's see if he knows about this card though. Maybe it means something to him. I don't really want to do that. Nope. And I'm sure there's something to do with these bodies as well. The can opener wouldn't work there. It was a gruesome idea. I don't think this will do either. I don't really want to do that. All right. Well, we're not going to baste them. Mm. I don't really want to do that. Not while he's watching. <gasps> we do. Oh my gosh, we're going to plant the tags on one of these so that it looks like Naran has gone for good. Are you sure you're looking hard enough? Oh look my goodness! Well. These old eyes are tired. I'm doing the best I can, but the average retirement age beachcomber has more sophisticated equipment than I've got here. Well, I happen to have a metal detector. I could loan you. Oh, I'm so excited for figuring out this puzzle. Would a metal detector help the cause? Well? Hey, just like downtown. You never know what this'll turn up. I you have an idea. A belt buckle with somebody's name on it. <laughs> Who would wear a belt buckle with the... <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, what's huh. this? Velasco, it looks like I've got one of your boys down here in the morgue. A sailor by the name of... Naranja. What? How? Well... Sprouted. But... Ah, oh, this town's going to hell. Sailor can't even take a two-day shore leave without watching his back. Yeah, yeah, I'll come down in the morning. All day long, Manny, I sought through pure sadness. I find evidence, and I piece together stories. But none of my stories end well. They all end here. And the moral of every story is the same. We may have years, we may have hours, but sooner or later, we push up flowers. I still want to know what happens to the dead who die. I feel kind of terrible now, though. We just faked Naranja's death, and the, our captain actually seems a little distraught. You know, this is one of his sailors. This is someone he cares about. And we're going to go and pester him for a spot on his ship now. Oh, I heard Naranja's gone, so you got room for me, right? Like, oh, that's so awful, Nanny. But we're going to do it. All right, I just want to look at my inventory. Just to make sure game's being consistent. And I'm sure it is, but... Okay. Yep. Less items to mess around with. We still have the baster, but okay. So, what do I want to do now? I want to get back to my place. That's what I want to do. I gotta remember where it is. Up here. Okay, so we found the use for the key. That's done. Anything to look at out here? Gross. How long was that <laughs> raven sitting there? Take Gross. a peek. No? It's bolted down. 
Hey, you lazy bees. Get off your abdomens and get to work. Don't yell at the bees. Okay, okay. That's enough of that. Um, you know what? I did this before, too, and I got... There we are. So, let's see if we can find any type of, like, hose or something in here. Anything new with you, Lupe? Evening, Lupe. Hi, Manny! No, okay. Okay, back to work. Okay! So... Maybe we should actually go up. Okay, that goes outside. Do we have anything useful here? Can we pick up this pen? I've always meant to hide that better. Le numéro gagnant, le 22, noir, Peripa, 22, black. There's got to be something we can do with this. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your bets. Mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, no more bets, please. Le numéro gagnant, le 16, rouge, père et manque, 16, red. Okay, so. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, si vous... ladies and mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Okay, so I can rig it. There's got to be a reason that we want to do that. Something with this fella. Police Chief Bogan, Rubacaba's finest. Rubacaba's only, for that matter. You know, some people say you should always walk away from the table when you're on a winning streak. Oh, yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Yeah? Well... You know, oh, yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. What can I do with him? I don't really want to do that. I've got nothing to say to him. <laughs> so contemptuous. Okay. So I think what I really need to do is probably go talk to Terry in jail. And then maybe that will open up some dialogue options with Bogan here. And we're going to have to mess around somehow with his bedding. Alright, yeah. I'm not sure at this point if we're going to want to make him lose or if it would be beneficial to make him win. But we'll get to it. Okay, first let's go talk to Terry. Okay, so fastest way to the jail, Manny. What do you think? Uh, down here, yeah. And then right over here. So I should have stopped over there right after we got done talking to Membrio, but this will do. Hey, buddy. Poor Terry. This is all my fault. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Terry. That was a beautiful speech out there. Yeah, maybe so, but it landed me in here. Don't worry. I'll get you the best lawyer in town. Okay, Manny, but quick! Before the movement loses its buzz! All right, well, anything else? How you holding up, hero? Manny, you got to get me out of here. I'm a victim of society. I'm working on it. How you holding up? Okay. I'm, a I'm working on it. Do we have anything we could give him that could be useful? I don't know. Does he care about Salvador Lemones? Manuel, I'm sorry to hear that you have not. You must be patient. Ah, no. He still thinks I'm in love with her. 
Okay, no, we don't need that. At least not here. Drink, Terry? I don't really want to do that. Oh, come on. Be nice to the fella. I don't think this would really be useful. But... I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't think this will work, because I tried it a bunch of times. Yeah. Alright, alright, alright. And what else do we have? I think that's probably going to be it. The key's not going to do. It wasn't for here. I don't think we want to give him a turkey baster. On the off chance, Jerry. You have any idea what this means? I don't really want to do nah. that. Nah. Okay, I didn't really think so. Okay. Alright, a weird idea, and this may well not work. We need some kind of, like, paper to use in this, right? Me and this ticket printer, we're gonna make a mint. To print up tickets? So... Can we use it with this? I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. I didn't want you to get rid of it. I want you to print up some tickets. Or... Oh, I'm a fool. I just needed to interact with it. Oh my goodness. Okay, well that's how you do. All right. So what did I just get? It's a betting stub for let's see, Monday, week one, race one. All right. We need to do something with this for sure. Mm, over here. I can't believe it took me this long to figure out how to use that thing. So it's looking like we can probably select the, the days and the weeks and everything. So how do we know which one we want? We could talk to Glottis. Or we could talk to the guy. Well, let's talk to let's try handing in the one that we've got. And see if we get any useful dialogue to help us pinpoint what we want to do here. Anybody there? I told you, we don't give out the kitty hats till Tuesday. Here. But I want a kitty hat. Oh, another Chowchilla Charlie original. Give me one good reason not to throw you out of here. Because I'll tell Max to fire you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that was not useful. Um, What about this guy? Hello? Oh, hi! Betting stub, please. Oh, wow. Uh, oh, bye. Okay. Me and this ticket printer, we're gonna make a mint. Alright, select it, use it. So, what day is it today? They don't give out the kitty cat hats till Tuesday, so it's not Tuesday. Eh, whatever. I just want a stub. Here you go. Hello. Oh, hi. Betting stub, please. Hey, there you go. Hey, this looks different than our usual ticket. Well, that's because it's from uh, last season. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. It's just a bunch of cats. Yeah, but look how <laughs> fast they're running. Ah, oh. sorry, sir. I'm sure you'll be a winner next time. Okay, wait. From last season, so we need oh. You are gonna be useful. Be this regal and majestic feline was her until her career was suddenly and tragically cut short on the second week of the racing season when the airship Olivia One on its maiden voyage crashed onto the track mid-race 
and exploded. Many bereaved fans testified later that before the blimp hit, Sanspoof was in the lead. Okay, so... Beloved Sanspoof, this regal and majestic feline A under favorite. her career was suddenly second and tragically week of the racing cut short season. on the second week of the... When the airship Olivia Manny Bury was in... But what was the day? Me and this ticket printer, we're gonna make a mint. Alright, Sanspoof. So, which number is this? And the kitty cat hats are, are probably Tuesday in memory of Sanspoof, right? So... Okay, there's something that I've got wrong here. What number cat is Sanspoof? It's gotta be like something to do with that. I don't really want to do that. You don't want to look at it? Wow, somebody really liked this cat. Okay, one more time, looking at the sign. Beloved this regal and majestic until her career, when the airship Olivia won on its maiden vo- Many bere- was- Okay. Alright, let's see what we got here. Where'd my ticket go? There we go. Race week day. Okay, so it was the second week. It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday. Week two, race two. So I don't think that's quite right, but we are on the right track. Hello? Oh, hi! Betting stub, please. Here you go. Ah. Oh. Hmm. There you are. Just cats. Cats egg. Sorry, sir. Okay. I'm sure you'll be a winner. I'm clicking the wrong way, like, every time. Okay. So. Tuesday. Race one, week two? Is this the weeks? Well, we'll figure it out. It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday. Week one, race two. No, we need, okay. Tuesday. Like that, right? Or is that what I just I'm I lost it that fast. Oh, I forgot which way I did. Um Alright. It's a betting stub for let's see. Tuesday. Week two. Okay. Race one. This should do it. Hello. Oh, hi. Betting stub, please. Here you go. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. Cats again. Cats again. Sorry, sir. I'm sure you'll be a winner next time. Crap, I'm missing something. All right, I'm going to go ahead and wind the episode down here. Please like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this. Come back and next time we will figure out this ticket puzzle. I don't know what we're going to win from here, but we're going to win something. And then I think after that, what do we want to do? We have to figure out how to get Terry out of prison. Uh, we have to figure out how to talk to Nick. we got a lot of things to do.